Hi, I'm James Randi. The Pegasus Awards are given out annually by the James Randi Educational Foundation in order to highlight parapsychological, paranormal, or psychic fakers that we find to be so harmful to society. We're officially announcing the awards for April the 1st, 2012, which is what we do every year. The winner of the Pegasus Prize in the Scientist category is Daryl Bem for his shoddy research that has been discredited on many accounts by prominent critics, such as Drs. Richard Wiseman, Stephen Novella, and Chris French. Such examination shows very strange methods used by Bem to prove his case, which ends up unproven, though the popular media, of course, have chosen to embrace it. The Pegasus Award for funding goes to Syracuse University for their continuing promotion and support of facilitated communication. The reason is pretty obvious. You see, facilitated communication is a system that Syracuse University says really works. What they do is they appoint a facilitator, a person who holds on to the hand of the autistic child. That child can be looking all around the room or even looking down at the floor or singing or humming, paying no attention to what's going on, and the facilitator takes the child's hand and moves it around the keyboard. So the facilitator, the adult sitting there, is actually doing the communication. Obvious? Of course. And the media Pegasus this year goes to TLC, that's the Learning Channel. They have a collection of shows that promote belief in paranormal falderall. They used to have more science, and of course they have our friends the Mythbusters on their sister network, the Discovery Channel, but they also have shows like The Long Island Medium, which is just utter nonsense, dangerous stuff. And lo and behold, ladies and gentlemen, the annual Pegasus Performer Award this year goes to The Long Island Medium. That's Teresa Caputo in its second season. Can you understand why? Well, there's a good reason. They know there's money in it, and as long as they see money in it, they will repeat it, and they'll do it again and again and again. That's the way the media is. Bottom line is the dollar. And the Pegasus Award this year in the category Refusal to Face Reality is James von Praag, who still peddles his nonsense even after we've exposed him time and time again. JREF President DJ Grothy and a team of our volunteers even brought a zombie group to one of his spirit circles. That's a big viral video now, and you can find it on YouTube. And it's got great press. But rather than just admitting how much of his stuff is utter nonsense, Von Prague just keeps plugging away. But don't say that he's refusing to face reality, really. No way. He knows that no amount of evidence will ever convince the true believer. And ladies and gentlemen, that last reason is why we do the annual Pegasus Awards. I'm James Randi.